Can social media help in winning wars? Ukraine is gaining support from all over the world on social media. This has led to Russia organizing domestic propaganda against its own people. Russia's President Putin is leading the war against Ukraine. But if you peek behind the curtains, there are in fact four women who are leading Putin's propaganda war. Who are these women? Wars can't be fought just with arms and weapons. When Russia invaded Ukraine, many protests rose across St. Petersburg and Moscow in Russia. Many Russian protesters were arrested from the streets. After this, Russia started a domestic information campaign against its own people. Leading the propaganda war for Putin is Maria Zakharova. She is the Director of Information and Press Department at the Russian Foreign Ministry. Maria is known to be fierce with her responses. Before the Russian invasion, she actually asked the West, when is the next invasion? We have to plan our vacations. Russia has blocked the BBC's website and Maria said, it is just the beginning of the response to an information war unleashed by the West. She has many times accused Western journalists of information terrorism. The next woman lead of the Kremlin's propaganda war is Margarita Simonian. She is the editor-in-chief of Russia Today. In fact, she is sanctioned by the EU for promoting Russian troops in Ukraine. She is a well-known figure in Russia and is always on top among influential women. A few days back, when Putin recognized Kremlin-backed regions in Ukraine as an independent state of Russia, she said, I don't understand why there is no champagne in the studio. She says she is overwhelmed with joy over Russia's invasion. The third one leading Russia's information war is Maria Butina. She is a member of Duma, the Russian Assembly with advisory or legislative functions. In 2018, the US convicted her of being a Russian spy. She pleaded guilty to her charges and was sentenced to prison for 18 months. She was released from prison after nine months and was deported back to Russia. In 2021, Maria was elected to the state Duma as a member of United Russia. Next and final on the information war is Valentina Matvienko. Valentina is a Russian senator and the speaker of the upper house. Interestingly, Putin's supporter Valentina was born in western Ukraine. She was the first female leader of St. Petersburg. During an assembly address, she said, Invasion is the only way to end this brotherly war. These four women are leading Russia's propaganda war. Meanwhile, the EU has banned Kremlin media and social media giants like Facebook and Twitter have imposed regulations against the Russian information outlets. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today News Mode.